Oh! What is that? All right, everybody, Baron here, and welcome back. Oh, yes, welcome back to They Are Billions. However, you're able to get the game now. It is the Steam release for, I believe, Early Access for They Are Billions, which is a steampunk strategy game set in a post-apocalyptic planet. To me, it's almost like Kingdoms and Castles mixed with StarCraft in a zombie apocalypse, and it's steampunk themed, which is a particular interest of mine. So we are going to build and defend a colony to survive against the billions of infected Zeds that seek to annihilate the few remaining living humans which we are protecting in our little colony. So anyway guys, I'm very excited. I am, I really enjoy this game. And if you want to see more, if you want to see me beat it, let me know. And let's get into the action. All right, so after quite a few searches, basically this game is all about procedural generation, right? So I had to make sure that we had the core resources around us. I basically did my due diligence. I scouted the map and I kind of like this area because I have a lot of access to wood, which is gonna be very helpful in the early game. However, you could say that at least at present, it seems that I don't have the most access to stone, which is kind of like the second tier of technology, right? But I do like the wood. I do like how I can have, I have access to this wood and wood over here, as well as over here, and then a lot over here. I feel like we've got, we're gonna have pretty good access with that. So I'm gonna have no trouble, well, minimal trouble, blocking off my points and then having enough wood to continue building. Right now, my mayor actually gave me the technology to research and market, so it can buy and sell resources. That's pretty good. It automatically sells excess resources produced. That could get us pretty strong in terms of gold from the beginning. I'm pretty excited for that. I've actually never researched the market. So what, I think one of my best starts ever was actually, it got a corrupted save file, which was really unfortunate because it was like the best save I've ever had. All right, so let's see. We're gonna move you up here. We'll keep you there. I guess we've got these two guys kind of guarding this area. This is the rougher perimeter. So I'd like to kind of have, get up walls early. Maybe expand towards this way. So basically how I start it is I always create food first and then I start scouting the map. Then after that starts happening, I get some uh, tents up, some co like basically tents get my population up. So I start getting that gold flowing in. Look at that, we're doing pretty good on gold. And then our wood production is 12. I wanna expand over here and then block this choke point off. I haven't found any cities of the Zed just yet and I like this area I can expand there so I'm gonna expand over here and block it I block these two choke points using this rock and I think that'll definitely be pretty good so let's go ahead and expand this like look at this this is our coverage so I'm gonna expand this way and then once that's done and I've got eight houses over here let's see how are we doing on food we need more food so we're gonna use hunter cottages. Cannot be built too close to other units. Well, I'm only gonna be able to fit one in here, so I might as well maximize it and do it at a 15. Yes, I'm able to get a 15 source of wood. Now, can I fit a fisherman's cottage here? Let's see, so the cool thing about pausing, oh, it blocks it. All right, well, I don't need really the fisherman footage, or fisherman foot, fisherman footage, what is that? Because I don't even know if it would have been that great. Yeah, it's it's a 13, which is decent. But we really want that extra wood production to really put us up here. Now, I opted for an early quarry simply since I have the market. I figured I need stone in order to produce it, so I might as well get it. I feel like we're going to be in a pretty good situation in terms of gold. And I like how we've got a lot of building room. I just got to secure these early choke points. I actually don't know what's over here past this because it's a giant horde of Zed and we're gonna have to slowly work our way over there. So once I have the resources, I'm gonna block off this point and then I'm gonna be pretty happy about that and then we'll block off maybe here with a with a little, you know, a backup door. All right, so at this point I'm feeling pretty good. I've secured this point. I've got a nice 27 being produced here so i actually want to see where i can get my market you can see out of these resources the next thing i'm gonna have to work about is power and workers because we're doing decently well on food so i guess the market we're gonna need 40 stone for that so that's a little bit away let's go ahead and get our power generation up now should i put it over here let's see i gotta make sure that i can get my food in here because we might as well take advantage of that it's a nice 14 right there 
13, yeah, 14 food. I guess that'll have to do. These things are always, they need a lot of room around them, unfortunately. But I'm liking this, man. We, we've got, I feel relatively secure. This is definitely a big open border. And there's lots of zombies over there. A lots of, a lots of them. And look, we're expanding into this big area over here. That'll get us able to get some more wood produced as well as some more housing area because this is a relatively cramped area, but it's also the most secure, so let's do that. Now, I think the big thing to do is take your time when you're building. All right, so we're gonna start producing them along the wall, contour them to the rock walls. Now, let's see, uh, I'm gonna have to, I do want a soldier center, I'm gonna need 450 gold, six energy, and eight workers. Now we're producing the energy. I think we might want to go for a soldier center next so that we can start clearing us out. Research center would also be really good. A wood workshop. I like to get an early wood workshop. All right, so now we only need the gold. I say we go for it. Get some soldiers because we need to clear this out to feel more secure in this area. And then it allow me to... Oh man, we're gonna be in such a good position once that happens. The Soldier Senna just got done, now let's see. We've got plenty of food and workers to do this. And we only need workers, wood, and a bit of gold. So let's go ahead and get two of them out. We're low on gold, so actually let's go back and figure out where we want to start putting these houses. So this is always the tricky part, is trying to optimize this, right? Where do you want to... Put your houses, not enough resources. What are we low on? Trying to get them to fit in this area here. And we're at 25 stone. Once we get to 40, we can start thinking about the upgrade center. But let's go ahead and do this. This will actually be really good because then it'll allow me to start clearing these guys out. We're gonna start up here and work our way down. And you can see that they're kind of starting to creep in. And then our archer deals with them. Rangers to your stations, ladies. Nice shots there. And look, I love how you can zoom in, man. And just Excellent, excellent vision. There we go, we'll get another one of those. And now we're gonna go look at some housing. All right, so we've got our rangers starting to clear them out, but I think we're attracting some attention. But that's okay by me. We'll get a few rangers, but we don't wanna get too many because we wanna start basically not capping us out on rangers when we could be getting soldiers. However, to clear this area out, I think is an early priority. Every area is different. Ooh, and we're actually low on food, so let's focus on where we want to get our food. We can get a hunter's lodge, and there's plenty of really, really good bits of food over here. So let's see, can I get one here? I need a little bit more gold till I can- I want to maximize the food over here since we don't have farms just yet. This is excellent. So they're slowly going to start working their way down, so I think what I want to do is I want to see how can I- I need to expand up here and block off this choke. Alright, we've got the stone. Do we have all the other resources? Because I think this would be a coup. Oh, we need a total population of 200. Alright, well let's get the wood workshop so we can start researching and then I can get something like a farm and really make use of all this really arable farmland down here. So where do I want to stick the market? This is always a frustrating thing because it's such a big... I want to put a lumber mill there. It's starting to block. Oh man, it's just too thin. How about here? That seems like it could be good. Gosh, look how many zombies over here. So basically the goal here is to try to expand as quickly and uh, get as much land as you really can before day 10. So we just completed a mill over here in this corner. It was a nice little spot for it. We're about to get our research technology up. I think it's high time. Yeah, it's definitely high time. We get a few more houses out here. What? Oh God, I thought that was a zombie for a second. And that scared the living bejesus out of me. All right, so where do we want that? That would be blocking, so then can we do it here? Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Or should we have just had it so... Yeah, actually, never mind. That's not the most efficient thing to do, so we'll go ahead and just shift that. We'll delete that. We'll do a little row of two, and then the, this will be a, a doorway. And then we can continue to build like this. Oh, that's definitely... Can we put one there? Oh, yes. All right. Yeah, all right. We're, we're expanding the suburbs here. We're going to get a lot. Oh, and their food is food is stuck. That's why I'm going to research farms. I feel like that's going to be the best thing, especially with how many farms we could fit here. I think I could fit maybe two or three. Are Soldiers are in trouble. Jeez. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to need some reinforcements up here. Building 
Wood workshop completed. All right, now cottage. No, that's not what I want. I want the farms. It's 400 gold. I'm gonna save up for that first. Then I'm gonna get the cottages. And look at this. We're slowly clearing our way out here. So let's actually, ex you know, give a little extra soldiers. Yikes, man. There's a lot of Zeds coming from that way. All right, so how are we looking? We've got to make sure. All right, so at 400 gold, that's the next goal here. Now we're stocked up on wood, so I should spend that. There we go. Now what I'm going to do is go here and just kind of double up in certain areas where I, I just feel safer. And eventually it's going to be nice, right, to have that. Now basically the north and, you know, north and west is pretty strong. This is obviously the weakest. I believe at day 15, if you're on the 100 days, the traditional 100 days. Oh my gosh, there are so many zombies over here. We could get a quarry for iron. It would get low iron, but it would allow us to start producing soldiers. And I think before day 10, that would actually be pretty advantageous. So that's what we're gonna do next. Now that we've kind of secured this nice little spot over here. And I've got my guys kind of an avant-garde position ahead of the walls, but you know what? I like it. Gives me a little intel as to what's going on. Ooh, and we do have iron over here. Now I am realizing we're gonna be light on stone unless there's some really nice sources of stone over here, but we can get this source over here. But still overall, relatively light on it. All right, where do I wanna expand to? I've always gotta be doing that. Man, look how many are over here. I really hope there's not one of the cities of the Zed over here, cause that'd be pretty bad, but I can. Ooh, farm is completed, yes. It's gonna be very expensive. But I do, I am gonna have enough food with these two. So we're gonna be flush on food and then I can start working on other things. So I do wanna get a farm before I start researching since research does take gold. We don't have it, but look at this. We can get so much cool technology. If I could get snipers or ballistas before the first wave, I think we're doing pretty good there. Oh, look at this. Look how much food we're gonna get down here. Uh oh. We got some special zombies there. You see how they were faster moving. The guy in the tuxedo is a pretty easy to spot zombie that's a little bit special and a little bit worrisome. All right, so how much gold do we got, man? Because I'm ready to plop down a farm and get that crazy food. Yeah, boy. Get 64 food. Not going to have to worry about food for a long time now. Now, I do want to get a quarry up. What do we need? 30? Ooh, God. See, look. Who's this guy? What's your name? An infected fresh. Whatever that is. But once we get the iron, we start getting muskets. And then we're able to fight back. All right, so now I'm researching cottages, which is gonna allow me to upgrade my houses already that are already on the ground, which is good. So let's go ahead and push our guys a little bit more. Research technology finished. All right, we're gonna need a lot more gold. We are gonna need a lot more gold. So what, the best we can get is two iron. That's so bad. Look at that, 65 food. I am loving it. Oh man, this is, they're in a very precarious spot because they can get attacked kind of like, what, almost 180 degrees. But we gotta protect this iron mine, get some soldiers. It is day 10, hour four. I'm thinking we're looking pretty good, honestly. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with where we're at here in our colony to survive. This is, a, it's like kingdoms and castles, but with zombies is what it is. And I love me some kingdoms and castles. And I love me some zombies. But yeah, so let's see the upgrade cost. So this would cost three energy. Yikes, we're going to need to get some more energy before we kind of start planning. Let's see, can I fit one of the, ooh, I can fit one here. This is a really awkward spot where I can't really build too much. So I'm gonna put the power facility right here. And then did I wanna, okay, I got like, look at this beautiful little area. I'm so pleased with it. So pleased with it. Ah, good. We've got stone and iron over here. So once this iron is up, you're gonna see this one here. Iron, my iron production rate's at two and that'll allow me to start mining. Now, I don't wanna, I wanna, I wanna get either snipers or ballistas. Let's move down here a little bit and soldier, you go up north and kind of guard that spot. Now we can get our soldiers. Love it. That'll really help us clear this out a little bit faster. Oh yeah, I wanted to move down here. Kind of get a better idea what's going on. Look at these guys just raining down arrows on these faces. Mills completed. What do I want now? What do I want now? Let's get our first soldier since we got the iron. Now, do we start stone workshop? We don't really have stone yet, so. I mean, I guess we do, technically. 
All right, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna move our soldiers and secure this area down here and then build a wall. We're gonna build a wall that Trump would be proud of. Lord, there's a lot of zombies down here. Soldiers ready. Woo, we got a first soldier. Oh, soldiers are under attack. What's going on? Oh, they're in your face, aren't they? They are in your face. All the way to victory town. You're okay, though. You're all right, girl. Keep on fighting a good fight. Oh man, that's a lot of zombies to clear out. There's a lot of zombies pretty much everywhere to clear out. Ah! Fresh zombies. Oh, soldiers firing. Oh God. We have attracted the suit man. Oh man, we're attracting everybody. What's going on up here? Ooh, oh, what is this? Decrepited? Oh, I thought that was a special one for a second. I do not like that little area, man. It's it's tough. So many zombies to deal with down here. Oh, then they're slowly creeping. But we gotta secure the choke points. Once we're able to do that, let's see. Actually, can I? Not yet. I'm gonna need another one. Another Tessie Tower down here. It's day 12. We're only a few days away from the first wave. And right now, it's looking like they're coming here. I'm stockpiled on both wood and gold. And you know what? I think that we should probably... Well, I guess we're about to secure this, so that I'm expecting them to come this way. So we might need some backup walls along this part. So let's see, where can we get them? Oh, I guess we this Tesla tower should allow us, help us a bit. Here we go. Focus fire. Yeah, and we take them out. No problem with a full salvo of arrows. Soldier training is completed. You are going to go and join the firing line here. Now, how are we doing? We're short on workers. I should have been doing that. I need to always concentrate on economy, but what we're gonna do is upgrade our cottages in the most secure areas over here. These four. I just kinda wanna do it one by one. We're short on wood! Uh-oh. But I can get another wood factory up over here. We can get double digits all over the place. Oh man, and securing that, but I want it. There we go. That's actually one of the best, 11, along this route. And it'll allow me to get maybe two. I don't think three, but it's possible. And then we're getting more workers here. Yeah, I'm liking it, I'm liking it, I'm liking it. I kind of like to keep an eye on the armies. Man, whenever I see one of these crows, it freaks me out. Oh my gosh, hold up. This is not good because there's what? Three tuxedo guys coming in? So I'm calling in, I'm gonna call in two of them. Two of my soldiers. And then we'll keep those guys there on duty. Oh god. We lost one. So now we're gonna be attracting a lot with the gunfire. The gunfire is louder. Zombies are attracted to all their senses. But you know what? Let's let's get a little more aggressive uh, clearing then. That is so many zombies, man. But once we secure this choke point, see, I'm not sure if there's like a city of the Zed down here or what. Aha! They're coming from the south, so they're gonna be coming here probably. So let's go ahead and build up our walls. Luckily, I have just enough. Too many cl enemies close by? Well, then we'll build where we can. I'm gonna double up this wall. They could overflow up here. So seven hours till the infected are coming from the south. I don't, that's not south. I can, you definitely call that west. This would be north. This would be east. And this would be the south. So if they're gonna come in this way, I'm prepared for it. That's where my army is already. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, there's so many of them. We're, we're clearing them out though, we're clearing them out. I need to clear them out so that I can finish. What's this? Your colony gets two snipers or the soldier's salary cost goes down by 60%. I'm usually going for that. I didn't know we got second tiers of mayors. All right, we've only got three hours. This may not work, so I'm gonna need a fallback wall. And we're gonna have the fallback wall right here then. And... Not enough research. Yeah, if they're not gonna let me finish the wall I want, then I'm gonna get a wall nonetheless. All right, oh gosh. What is this? Oh God, that's a fresh. This is tough. Hmm, see, cause I'm not, man, I'm not, I'm not prepared for this necessarily. I've gotta pull these guys back. Oh my gosh, that was close. That could have been bad. 
All right, one hour. Well, we'll just pull back into this wall. Get them, boys. Oh, yeah. All right, see, now you can see them on the map. Look at this. And they're just getting distracted by the. Oh, my gosh. What did I do? What? This must be a city of the undead, man. I'm really worried about this. I do not feel secure in my position here. That is just so many zombies in this. Now, I'm, I'm curious. Wait. That's not the south, is it? Our soldiers are in trouble. Oh, God. What is... Aged. Yeah. Hmm. Well, at least we've got the two walls up here, but that is yikes, yikes, yikes. That's scary. You can definitely see this is not... I'm not super thrilled with this. I'm curious where they're going to go. And actually, I want to move... These two guys over here. These two soldiers to guard that gate, because... It, it says from the south, but I guess you could consider that the south. All right, well, then I've got to be prepared to adapt to that, to pivot to that, right? We doubled up the walls. Where else could I fit something? I could fit a sniper tower here. And I think I do want a gate here. Just, you never know, man. You can't be too careful. I mean, it's wave one, but still. I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> All right, well, then let's move most of the army up. And then we should be able to repel them with just sheer force of numbers. Be prepared for wave one! No, actually, you go ahead and get, get, get inside. The zombies are coming. Guard the gates. Prepare your butts. We've got some veterans here. Oh, wait. It's not done. I'm gonna put the soldiers, because if you're up in the tower, it increases your range. And, uh, the soldiers have the shortest range right now. Here we go. Here's the wave. Wave one coming in! Now they're gonna go after the distraction pole. <laughs> yeah, we got them. But sometimes you'll, you'll see that there's like waves coming in elsewhere. All right, what do we got? We're dealing with them. And then the rest of this area. Now this is my weakest spot. A zombie could have walked in and grabbed that and taken us all down. So I can't really expand too much down here. We did get the choke off. I gotta finish up here. So now let's move this army. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and get all you guys out. I think it's time to get the stone workshop. Good lord, I'm at 2,000 gold. Oh, and we're at a population of 212, which will allow me to get a market, which automatically sells excess resources produced. This is so good. And it's only a little niner. Little niner. Oh my god, what, what, it, why is that? And reduces the food needs of surrounding dwellings? So if I put it here... I can start building lots of houses. It won't really fit over here anywhere. Not really. Well... Guess we'll do that. Alright, so we're clearing out our Liebensraum. Our living area here. A ranger is now a veteran. Fantastic. Now we're getting access to stone. That looks like gold, and that's iron. New v or building available. The stone workshop. All right, what do we need? We need 15 workers, 20 energy. We're low on energy and uh, 40 stone. So let's go ahead and get our energy up first. Where can I stick a mill that's kind of out of the way? Ooh, that's a nice spot. That's a nice spot because I can't really build elsewhere over there. And I can fit another wood area over here. So this is gonna be nice, man. So all excess resources are just sold. But what happens? What, what happens when you have excess of gold, right? Get in the firing line, soldier. Yes, sir. You will secure this area. Now we're gonna we could put a lot of houses over here. Yeah, we're attracting a lot of stuff. But a key aspect of this game is to constantly clear the area. We've researched the ballista. Let's take a look at this bad boy. Now that'll be in my defense. No, military area. It's two workers, two energy, 20 gold, or 20 wood, and 500 gold. Now, I think we might want a warehouse soon, because then that'll allow us to store more stuff. Expands the maximum storage capacity. Now, do I want that before the stone workshop? I think so. Let's put it over here in the industrial district. So this... Oh, yeah, and then it actually would be really good over here as we're going to start expanding. That might be as good a spot as any, honestly. And it also increases the resource production. This is going to be key stuff, especially since we're limited on stone, so I need to put it over here, in my opinion. 
Alright, as we're going up here, I'm, I'm seeing a lot more resources. But there's a lot of Oh god, we're, we're just gonna- Oh, this is a big wave of them, man. We've, uh, stirred the nest here. Zambi's coming from all directions, boys. Well, not all directions, but enough directions to where it feels like it's all directions. Oh my god! This is one of those where, like, do we need to pull back? I like the little extra effects now. That looks new. The little shot damage effects. All right, all right. So the warehouse has been completed. We're low on workers, but let's get... Actually, yeah, let's let's upgrade. We need that so that we can start getting some quarries up because I do want more stone. All right, we fully encircled our base. It's tenuous currently, but I, I'm so pleased with that, especially with how, how aggressively we're clearing out this area over here. So this is what, day 19? I don't know when the next wave's gonna come. Maybe day 20, day 25, day 30. There's some n big old nasties over here, man. There's a lot of just undead. We got ourselves a patrol here. I think it's time to start getting more stone production. Ooh, we cleared out a big chunk and we've got like fresh ground now. So now it's a matter of figuring out which choke points to go for because I, I'm definitely and expand towards the choke points kind of a guy. And we don't want to like get it, venture out too much because then we fight the big nasty. So this is my biggest and weakest wall. I do want this first though. I want my stone workshop. It expands the maximum storage capacity. We've already got our warehouse in play. So I don't think I need that just yet. I want to save up for this, which means I need, oh, I'm short on energy. Bummer, dude. So we've almost reached the edge of this map over here. So I, I, uh oh, day 21. You know what? I'm, I've got this feeling that this is my weakest area. Oh, this is nice. So I want to put that here. I want to put it here because I think, how many of these can I buy? I built a Tesla tower here so I could build outer walls. But let's get these two guys going first. Man, I can even produce another one? No, not enough resources, right? No, there's enough resources. Now, where, where do you fit this guy in? Stone is done, so I want to research the stone walls first, and then stone gates. If I can get stone research before this next wave, I'm sitting pretty. It's better be good. Oh, so pretty. All right, so what we've got here is we've got the army here. I'm going to send them north. And kind of figure out what's going on here, because I could expand here. All the way. Let's attract some attention, boys. Do your jobs. And then what I'm going to do is wall this off. No. Oh, man, I didn't pause it. You, you... Oh, God, really? <laughs> well, whatever. It's always better to build while pause so you can cancel when you make stupid mistakes like that one. Now, do I want to put... I think I want to put a ballista here. Because it kind of covers both areas. Not very well, mind you, but... Mm. And the ballistas, I think, will really help on wave two. But I, I think it's overkill, honestly. I think I think we're doing real good. Eight hours, heading from the west. Okay, well, look at that. that I've just built a nice bit of ballistas over here. And uh, how's stone production going? Got a decent amount of it. It's going to be done in time. So we'll hold here, finish them off. We got two hours till they attack from the west. It is way too time. Come on, give me that stone. Give me that stone and then I'm pausing it. All right, they're on their way. Now that would be 500 gold. I can afford it. And then let's go ahead and get these. We'll upgrade those. And then we'll upgrade this inner wall. You never know if they're gonna get in. I mean, I hope not, especially not with this uh, ballista here to help. But it's kind of a trek from here to there. Not too crazy. You're- tell me you're able- Is this ballista not able to fire over that stone wall? Oh my god, that might be a terrible spot to put it. Alright, well, if they're coming from over here, I'm gonna call in all available resources. All available, men! I don't think it's gonna- we're not gonna have time. Alright, actually, yeah, let's just... Call the army over. They could attack actually here as well, but with two ballista towers- Oh, are you going outside the walls? You ballsy sons of guns. And the zombies are on route to attack the base. Come on now. What you got for me? What do they got? What do they got? What do they got? I think I think we're gonna be able to deal with them. Oh, oh, oh! I can, I can research that while they're, 
while it's being researched? Oh, I'm researching a stone tower? What an idiot. Why on earth would I research a stone tower? All right. Oh, the ballista is crowd control, boys. But these gates are definitely the weak spot. The ballista's doing some work, boys. Oh, yeah, we got this no problem. They're not even gonna get past the front gate. Not even gonna get past the front gate. Now, there are other attacks that will happen, I think. Oh, I wanted to repair you. Repair! And now the ballista's just cleaning house. There we go. I got the repair in. Ha! Get wrecked, gentlemen! Get wrecked. We got it. We got it. We got it. All right. Now, what am I... Oh, my God. I cannot believe I researched... Research bank. Do we want a bank? Increases the amount of gold generated by each colonist? That would be nice. But I think we want the stone house, maybe. A foundry. Allows research of complex buildings and units based on iron? <gasps> the Iron Age! I think I'm gonna go with the power plant for now. All right, so we're upgrading our farms over here in our nice little bread basket, which I'm very pleased with. Technology research is completed, my lord. All right, so we don't have enough gold just yet, and we are low on stone, so the next thing I'm gonna do is get stone production up and running over here. This is also a nice little bit of stone, so we might wanna slowly get these two choke points isolated. Let's move over here first. Oh, God. They're attacking! The rangers are at the front. I wish you could have it so your soldiers were at the front and rangers were behind. There we go. There, the ballista's working. Alright, let's go ahead and upgrade that. Pull back, boys. I don't know what we did, but we attracted a lot of them. We're gonna pull back behind the gates. That is freaky, deaky, and we ain't want none of it. Come on down and say hi to my stone walls and my firearms. We've got 87 food, 19 power. And let's go ahead. We, we, we need this, man. We need this. Let's get a quarry up. Now, can I get anything better than five? Five is the best we can do. Then there's only a little... Whoa! Gold! Gold! Ooh, four iron. I want four iron for sure. For iron. My life for iron. Ha! Uh, oh, wow. Yeah, there's kind of a, a little bit of an attack going on across the uh, north here. This is such a sloppy little choke point, but it'll work. Actually, I could put another one there. Yeah, and we'll, we'll take him out. We'll take him out in the safety and security of our own home. Well, wow. This... We need to upgrade this wall when I can afford it, which is going to be a while, because we're using so much stone. And this warehouse should up the production of stone. So we're at, what, plus five right now? Tell me I go up to, like, plus a billion. There we go, and our soldiers in the front and rangers behind. I like that. Oh! What is that? I've never seen this thing before. Ah! There's another one. Pull back, boys. Pull back. What is that? Pull back! It looks like he's spitting at- Oh my god, what is this? We have an acid spitter, boys. Ooh, and I've got no ballista to secure my- Okay. Whatever that is, we're attracting some nasty nasties. Oh, we got no energy? I have lost confidence in this armed force. We need to research the next units. Because if we attract another one of those freaking Hydra units... Mother of God. Well, look at this. We got a conga line of zombies coming. And I've got these newly created snipers that I've got. And I've got a few headed to different areas, but I might want to move one up here kind of guard this area and especially over here I feel like what do we got going on down here man yeah the snipers really helping out down here I think we might want to put look at this I think we might want to put a tower down here a stone one at that that'll really help me I think this might actually be my weakest spot oh my god that ballista is really good once they get close he's I I didn't know that you couldn't fire over the stones I was like oh that's a really smart spot to put it all right, new sniper, what do we want you? Over here's the weaker area. A stone tower would be good up here as well. Because I did get rid of that other one. <laughs> yeah, let's put one there. Weaker areas need to be covered. 
Now, I, I gotta watch out for where that spitter thing was. Let's see if we attract a lot of attention this time around. Ooh, I can build a power plant. How big is this thing? I wanna tuck it in somewhere nicely. We'll tuck it in over here. Now, how much power does that do? 160 energy? Oh my god, that is glorious! Whoa, who's in trouble? Oh, it's a spitter. We're gonna let the ballista take care of him. Fire, ballista! Pew! Nicely done, nicely done. Those things are scary. And I don't like them at all. Oh, they're attacking from the east. I was expecting the west, honestly. So that means over here... All right, so before this goes, then we're gonna need a double up wall for sure. We are out of stone already, guys. Okay. Now, if they break in, it's pretty much a clean... Hmm. But I, I think I want a second great ballista. All right, here they're coming. So they're probably gonna hit here. Let's see, can I, can I build... Do I need to repair any walls? Gotta repair two gates. Oh, and we're low. Could I put... What? Not enough resources for that? Yikes! We're low on gold, boys! Alright, here comes the army. Got the sniper up in the tower. So, they could split their forces. This is what? Wave 3, right? Okay. Mmm. I would feel... We can still double up back here. Now, do I want to back up... Like a backup wooden wall, just in case? Probably, right? You always gotta just account for it, right? So we don't exactly know where they're gonna come from. So I want this army here. Look at that, that's finally done, just in time. It looks like they're heading up here. So, I should be able to get a few more walls so I can, in fact, make this a double wall. And then I, I want some chewing, some chewing wood for him. Eat that. Eat this wall, you sons of guns. That'll distract them, allow our ballistas to fire a little bit more. Here they are. Can I put a wall around here? Not enough resources to create this building. All right. We've got one sniper over there. Ooh, and they are coming this way. But I'm gonna call this sniper up here. They've gotten through that. Oh man, is that it? Is that all you got or is the horde moving? What? You gotta be kidding me. Horde three was not really a problem. All right, now I'm gonna call the sniper up to there. Now I want the foundry, okay. I was really, really worried, but we just absolutely kicked their butts. All right, maybe I should expand and take this area. That's some nice building room, plus some iron. That We are in the iron age now, after all. How is stone? Stone is still trickling in. There's a little bit of stone right there. Yeah, this is such a funny little gate, but you know what? I like to have extra fallbacks. And we're gonna take this area. We get iron. Ooh, look at that. Oh man. We've got no sniper support here, though. Oh, there they are. He's just real slow. Okay. Let's look to see the foundry. I need 20 workers. I'm short on workers. I'm short on food. Stone gold. I'm short on all of it. So to get more workers, first we're gonna get... We're gonna need food. Oh, we're gonna have to get a new farm. <laughs> yeah, I love farms. I don't know why, man. I've always loved farms. I think it's because it's like a basic resource and you know you're gonna need it. And I love this, man. We have such a surplus in energy due to this factory, or rather, this power plant. I guess would be the uh, better, the more proper nomenclature. But yeah, I, I feel better about this. Actually, I would like to have another wall. So maybe, maybe that's where we need. This is, this is still kind of weak to me, but this is technically the weakest, so we should secure that. In terms of number of walls, right? That one's only two, whereas the rest is at least three, or four in some cases. I guess I can upgrade that bad boy. Oh, let's think. Let's get a bank. This looks like an interesting area. We got some stone and iron, so we could have a double up mine. We are attracting a lot of attention. I've got snipers, I've got soldiers, I've got rangers. 
I'm not sure... You know, I really want that foundry, and that's what we're trying to do here. Ooh, I can build a lookout tower. We need a surplus of 20 workers. Ooh, okay. We're almost there. Operation Foundry is in full effect. Once this cottage is done, we can- Ah! Jeez! That thing- those things scare the crap out of me. He's got such a terrifying yell. Okay. Foundry it is. We need the 30 stone. The stone's gonna take forever, man. And gold. Oh god, that crow. It moves so fast. Do you think it's a bad guy? I do. Every time. I don't know. Still haven't learned my lesson. Aha! We can finally build the foundry. I've never built one of these. Oh man, this is kind of like my third playthrough. Well, no, technically my fourth. My third one, I had the best dream start, man, but I just... The game just... It... I got a corrupted save file. Now this is gonna be great. I think that we're gonna get some pretty cool units. I've seen some pretty cool looking mechs in the uh, pictures on the Steam Workshop, you know, and on their website. I feel like maybe another sniper and we'd be pretty good down here. Let's go ahead and make one. Oh, we got one. If we got one on hand, bring him on down. And we got one in the tower. He's not really... Might as well unload him. Bring him down here. Clear out this area because I would like this stone and iron. We're in the Iron Age. There's stone here. Maybe that would be the best. It, well, there's some really nice areas to expand. Ooh, more stone. <gasps> How are we doing up there? Fine? Yeah. The ballistas are able to deal with them. Oh my god, hold on. Yikes. We're going to lose this Tesla. Dang it. This little swarm. And then they get the units that were in it, and then I have to repair it. It's a big pain in the booty. That's pretty cool, man. The zombie's like, oh, I see this thing unguarded. Sends a swarm. Because apparently... Oh, what is that? Oil. Are there other units to bother? Sure. Okay, let's see what's going on down here. Oh, that sniper just covered my butt. Okay, we've got some... Yeah, I guess I could always attract them, right? Oh, they're going for it again. Ah, noobs. I gotta see what's over here. Ooh. Get out of my way, knuckle faces. The foundry is done. Uh, research radar tower, research engineering center. Oh, God. Assembles and trains the most sophisticated units. Ooh. Thanatos, Titan, Lucifer enables research. I've, I think the Titan is the unit that I want. So I'm actually gonna research that first. <gasps> oh my god, that's the next thing I want. This thing, the Executor. <laughs> I know I'm mispronouncing it because you never know with YouTube. Man, it might be like, that's uh, a bad word, demonetized. We gotta be careful, you know, you gotta be careful about those things. Oh man, this base is looking, look how much ripe land, but once they get in, the whole thing's lost. Oh yeah, I want that. I want that so bad. What is this? A shocking tower? Do we even want that? Spike traps, why not? Get one more sniper. Snipers are cool, but I feel like they're mid-game. We're kind of mid-game. We're day 38. Look at these three snipers, man. Drop, drop, drop. Drop them like it's hot. Come on, babies. What's going on up here? We got a little, we got a little uh, skirmish going on. Repair. What I do like is I can double click and it selects all of mine out there. This is definitely the weaker area. Alright, we got a problem. They are approaching from the east. We... Uh, it's wide open is really what it is, man. And I've been trying to save up my stone here. Well, at least we can build a preliminary gate. Now, do we even want to do a gate at this point? I don't think so. So we'll pull everybody back. And if they're attacking from the east, I'm expecting it to be here. It could be here again, but I still think this is the weaker spot. We gotta be prepared at the weakest spot. So let's go. Oh god. Not enough resources to create this building already. Yes, sir. We're gonna try to do it. We're gonna try to lock this area in. I'd rather not lose it if I don't have to. Five hours. Let's move the army here just so they can respond. And the veteran sniper as well. We don't want to lose him. Get back to this. Uh, stone is only at a production rate of seven? How? Oh yeah, they're attacking here again. Okay. 
Oh wow, they're already here. I wish I could give them a little bit more to munch on. And we can't upgrade this because we don't have the stone. Okay, the army needs to be there now. This is what, Horde 4? I wish they... Oh, those are just my groups. There should be kind of like a little milestone, so you you have an idea of what's going on, right? Can we, can we even build stone? Let's just finish it off with stone. I mean, wood. Might as well. Makes, it'll make me feel better, because I'm pretty sure that area's gonna get attacked. We've only got two ballistas right now. Ha! It is being attacked. And we've got one guy down here. Oh my god. Wait, hold on. Oh my god! I really hope these ballistas can do what they need to do. Were those jumpers? Oh, these guys are actually holding off that area down there. I'm happy about that. Now they're getting to the stone part. And look, everywhere else is getting slightly attacked. But we held off that horde. We did it! Oh man, I'm, I'm feeling so good about this. Our defenses are being attacked. I'm gonna have to... Oh! That's not what I wanted to bulldoze. I wanted to bulldoze... Son of a biscuit. Biscuits. Alright, but I think that we're gonna need to start really up in what we got. Oh, I really want to research this executor here, but I feel like the best unit would be to save it for that. I need a bank, don't I? I need that bank, son. But we need 50 wood. Where's the other thing? The oil. Oil platform. It must be placed over an oil pool. Oh, here's one. My first oil production facility. Ha ha! Because I need, I need a lot more stone coming in. We are low on stone. That'll get me advanced quarries. So that gets me one stone. Is there any way I can get two stone? All right, so our oil platform's been completed. Check this baby out. So it produces 12 oil, which I like, I like. Now I should be able to produce advanced quarries. So we need 20 oil to upgrade to an advanced one. Now we gotta find our best quarry. This one's, that one's getting gold. This one's getting five stone. This one's getting five, and it's the most secure. Let's let's upgrade that one. So we need the 20 oil, which we should get on the next kind of cycle of income here. A choose mayor level three. Research radar tower or research advanced mill? Uh, I'm gonna go with advanced mill. That's like the sawmill, right? Yeah. All right, we've got an advanced quarry on the route. In route. Now, what do we want to start researching? We got 2,000. We got the advanced mill. I want this executor. Executor. Or rather, I want the bank the most. I need 50 freaking stone. Let's go to our market. All right, we just bought our bank. Ugh. What are, what are we... Day 46. I'm not sure when the next wave's gonna come, but we've got these little radar towers, and look, we found a city of the Zed. And there's just an insane amount of Zeds up here. I really want the, uh, the really elite units. Here's my barracks. We need lots of gold. We are low on gold, but this bank should increase production of gold in this, uh, in this district, but we're very low on stone. We're getting attacked from the east again. Fantastic. All right, so this is what? It is day 50. Woo, boy. We are up against it now. I'll tell you that much. Ooh, those guys, man, those guys look like it. All right, so from the east, oh my. That's Ballista's just cleaning house. Okay, but that's not where they're being, they're gonna attack from. So the east could be here and here again. Um, do I even have the resources? I've got plenty of stone. I'm gonna try to hold them here. We have no ballista support though. And we'll have the other gate here. Ready? We'll put it out. And then when we know they're we when we know they're where they're coming from. So we've got plenty of gold. I like the little munchy wood stuff. He <laughs> tricky tricky. 
All right, now, did we... We haven't researched the executor yet. Target... Ooh, target priority highest. That's cool. I guess, actually, you know, I want you... I want you on nearest, and you on highest. Hmm. All right, now, do we have any towers down here? No, we do not. Okay, where are the valuable units? I have not really upgraded much. But that that's held off pretty well so far. We don't know what kind of units they're going to have, though. But we do have the backup wall, which I do... I, I, I enjoy that. I like that. Let's just... let's just do it. Might as well get it up and going, right? Alright, they're one hour away. If it spawns up here... Oh, yeah. Alright, then I'm fairly certain they're not gonna hit this. Well, actually, it's so close for them, yet so far for me. I don't know. I'm, I think they'd attack here, right? But if we, if we make that gamble, I'm gonna keep the snipers down here and I'm gonna move the rest of the army up because they're reactionary. They're trying to break through. Oh God, there's no guards down there. Yikes. That was a mistake. You, sir, go cover the gates. Aye, Captain. All right, here they are, right? They're coming? Okay, what do we got? Oh, we got big boys, hold on, what is this? An infected chubby. He's got 600 hit points as opposed to a colonist with 45. And there's fresh with 50 and an executives with 80. Oh boy. Uh, can I sneak in another? I'm gonna try to do it and I'm gonna wall it off. All right, so here it is, right? Well, all my snipers are down here for now. Don't walk that way, you knuckle face. Jeez. All right, how are we gonna do? They're up against the stones. Okay, we got it. These ballistas are doing what they need to do. We might lose the first bit of stone walls. They, they love to attack up here. Ah, oh, they did take down some of it. Nicely done, we've repelled the invasion. There might be some subsequent fla uh, splashes, right? If I was them, I would have hit from the south. Actually, sniper, come on down here. Never know if they're down here. All right, so we've got our snipers now. Pull the army back down. Do we want them south? Where do we want to expand? This looks ripe, all right. so we could take that. Actually, this has all been mostly secured as well. So we need to go where the resources are. I tried to scout. There's stone up there. Could build some isolated quarries. Just need to mass the resources. It's day 51. We're halfway there, guys. We are halfway to a victory. I think overall we've done pretty good. 50% done. Well, 51%. Maybe even a little bit more because it's what? Yeah. 51 point something something percent. Done. And I'm feeling pretty good about this. I think we need to expand to where the resources are. I haven't even scouted this out. So maybe that would be a pretty good idea is to put one of these little little nerd towers in to kind of give us some vision up here so i'm gonna do that all right guys my name is baron thank you for watching our first episode of they are billion steam release um if you want to see more baron's brigade you know what to do but generally speaking that's kind of i guess the first 50 days this is the farthest i've gone i think in my other save that was corrupted i think we could have gone pretty far i do like these little look i've got a scout tower here the lookout tower here and then I've got one where is it over here which allows me this increased vision so I'm building one up here to hopefully get a better idea of what's going on and I might stick one there but then again I might expand right so anyway I'm very excited about this save I'm feeling pretty good look at this um, we're selling all of the extras that we have we might need another bank because I only have a maximum storage of 4,000 and I would really really like Titan units which are these epic... Can I... Have I even researched them? No, yeah. Re, I have to research them. Then I have to build them. And these guys are the bosses. I'm really looking forward to them. Alright, guys. I will see you in the next one.